And welcome back to our special presentation tonight, Straight Shooting, the Gun Debate. 24 Hour News 8's Teresa Weekly looks back now at the last rifle ban. Teresa? Well, Marley and Brian, there are new calls to put another assault weapons ban in place on a federal level. Here's a look at the first ban that went into effect 24 years ago. Good job. President Bill Clinton announced the assault weapons ban as part of the crime bill in 1994. These things can be prevented. It was a reaction to several high-profile events, John including McGoffer a was. shooting in 1989 at an elementary school in Stockton, California. That involved a semi-automatic version of an AK-47. A few states put their own assault weapons bans into place that year, but it wasn't until Clinton signed the crime bill in September 1994 that it became a federal ban. This day is the beginning, not the end, of our effort to restore safety and security to the people of this country. Politicians have disagreed on how effective that ban was. Studies that the Department of Justice funded on the law say it was successful in reducing crimes committed with, quote, assault weapons, but that it was most likely offset by criminals using semi-automatics not on the banned list, which have large capacity magazines. The most recent report on whether the ban worked comes from Lewis Clarivis with the University of Massachusetts at Boston. In his 2014 book, Rampage Nation, he wrote that there was a 37% drop in deaths from mass shootings during the ban. However, a footnote in his book says that out of the 12 shootings in his data during the ban, only three involved assault weapons. Clarivis claims the key provision of the bill was a ban on high-capacity magazines capable of holding more than 10 rounds. Democrats in the House and Senate have introduced new assault weapons bans since last year. Neither has any Republican co-sponsors. And at this point, the NRA estimates there are as many as 15 million of these types of rifles in circulation in the United States. Now, people